kinds of soil are there? There's lots of different types of soil. Now, what do you think that is? Sand. Sand, Sand exactly. And what do you think that is? Clay. Clay. Now, feel how hard that is, right? Feel, feel how hard that is. Now, you want to know how you learn about soils. You learn about soils by what they do with water. What do you think will happen to water in the sand? Oh, it'll just suck it up. Yeah, exactly. It just goes and it just drains straight through. But clay, what's going to happen to the water here? Oh. It's going it's to absorb it. Yeah, so once this is wet, how long do you think it'll take to dry? I don't know, an hour. Oh, it's a long time, right? So water drains through sand, doesn't drain through clay. Like this is like a garden soil. What can you see in that? I Twigs, leaves. So how do you think the water will go in there? Um, it'll just absorb it. And what about this one? That's like a compost. That is going to hold water. But what about where we're sitting? In this garden here, if I go like this, what can you see? What, how, would you, how would you describe that? No, it can like, break easily. Yes, it can break down. So if it can break down, that means what? That the water can move through it. Whereas that, that clay's like a rock. It's really hard for the water to move through. Once it's in there, it's in there, right? So have a look. What's that grey stuff? Um, oh, that's um, sand. sand. That's like so this is a sandy soil. What would you say, if you were looking at this soil now, what would you say about it? Um, it's very sandy. Yeah. It's got a lot of roots. Yeah. Now that I've gone, look at this, just a little bit deeper. So on the top, we've got the nice organic layer, which is where the leaves and all the insects are breaking it down. See, look at, the, look at some of the insects. Can you see the ants and the bugs in there? But look, when I go down that much, what do we find? Pure sand, look at it. That, that's just sand, right? So for the right plants, this is the right soil. But for other plants, it's not the right soil because it's either what? This, is, this will get to what? The sand is gonna be dry. So that when you look at the plants you wanna plant, you need to understand the soil that they will like. And how do we improve soil? Water. Yeah, we need water. But what else do we Sunlight. need? Then we need to add this stuff. Compost. Compost. That's right. So when you add compost to that, that holds it all together and it'll hold water, OK? So soil is something that we can change. We can improve, OK? We can change it from sand into good garden soil. Do you want to pour a little bit of water into the sand. Let's pour a little bit in and see what happens to it. Just a bit. Stop. Where'd it go? Look. It's gone all brown. <laughs> and there's a hole in it. Yeah. But can you see the water? No, it just absorbed. But it's right. Yeah, and it's dry. Yeah. What if, on the other hand, we get some of this nice compost and let's put a little bit of water into the compost. What's the compost done to the, to the water? It's made it all wet. Yeah, it's made it wet. So, so what does that mean? It's, it's doing what? It's sucking, it's sucking it, up. it up. Yeah. And then when it's wet, is the water going anywhere? No. Ah. It's wet. staying in the soil. Yeah. So with the sand, it goes away. With the compost in it, it stays in the soil. Okay, now, let's go to our next friend here, which is the clay. Put some water in there. Okay, now, okay, take a piece of clay each and start to squeeze it out. Keep squeezing. Get the water in it. Can you guess what's happening here? It comes of soggy. Soggy, that's right. So if you were a plant's roots, would that be good or would it be not so good to try and live in there? Ah, not so good. Not good. What's happening as you add more water, it becomes more what? Soggy. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> Just went. What? <laughs> so what does this tell us? What's the difference between clay and sand? So clay doesn't drain. Clay keeps all the water there, but sand does drain. We can do a little soil test 
when we're anywhere, we can just go there and say, oh, okay, this is sandy. Or if we go and put our shovel in and it, it's like that, we can go, okay, that's a clay soil. What can grow in the clay? Or what can grow in the sand? Or what grows in nice garden soil? And how do we make, how do we go from clay to a nice garden soil? These are the things that you can learn and that you need to know if you're gonna create a garden. See, look at that. That's like a facial mask now. I could rub that on my face and have a Santa's beard.